Hey Pisces, welcome back and cross watchers. So let's see what's on and popping with Pisces this week. Remember Pisces, I could be picking up on you, the cross watcher or a third party, okay? So let's see what's on and popping with Pisces. Let's see. What is the overall energy between Pisces and their person? What else? What else? For Pisces, please. You know what? That wasn't my bad. Okay. What else? For Pisces. Okay, somebody here walked away. Pisces. Somebody here walked away. It could have been you. It could have been, you know, somebody you were dealing with. But somebody here walked away. I feel like you have no love for this person. I feel like you don't care about this person anymore. I feel like, you know, the love that you have, you once had for this person and the way that you care for this person is gone. I feel like you trusted this person and they broke every single trust that they had with you. You know, and I feel like you're moving to better things and, you know, things that are going to fulfill you. You feel me? And I feel like you're going to receive some good news. But for the most part, I feel like somebody here deceived you in some type of way and they broke every single trust. And I feel like it was the person you were dealing with, the person you were connected with emotionally. You know, it could have been a commitment. It could have been somebody you were just messing with. But this person broke every single trust with you and you're having no type of love with this person but you're moving up you know you want to start a new life you want to be with somebody you want you know the right person with you and you you know you want to head to that direction but when it comes to this person in particular trust was broken here so you might have left this person it might be the past person showing up and you're just moving on right now with something new let's see The Ten of Pentacles, family, wealth, success. Listen, you're moving up with those Nine of Cups, Pisces, to wealth, okay? You know, to things that you want, to success. You want to build a family. You want to have, you know, everything for your family. You want to build with a family. You want to have, you know, things for you and your children. You have children for you and your partner, you feel me? I feel like, you know, you're going to come into a lot of abundance, but not only by yourself. You're going to come into it with somebody, you know, because I feel like this person, you know, that you were with before, like when it came to like helping you with anything, there was no help. I feel like if you needed anything, whatever it was, you know, let's just say you wanted a plate of food, you needed medicine, you needed anything. This person didn't give it to you. Like, this person's a fucking evil motherfucker. I'm sorry. They didn't care about anything. They said they love you, but it's a lie. They didn't love you. They didn't care about nothing. They're a very controlling person. A very unstable person. A very selfish person i wanted to say son of a bitch like i'm picking up such a bad energy from this past person it's like such an evil presence that i'm feeling right now from this person like didn't care if a person died in front of their face including you they didn't give a fuck is the is what i'm picking up here my god from this past person so that's why i'm my God, I'm just feeding it. The evilness from this person. Let me continue because this person's getting in my energy. And man, whoever you were dealing with here, Pisces, you already know if you were dealing with this person. Like this person's going to go through it. They're not going to find family. They're not going to find success. They're not going to find nothing in their lives but their own shadow. That's what they're going to find. They're going to go through how I'm telling you right now. You're moving to bigger and better things. You're moving to abundance. Somebody might have offered you already. 
you know, to move forward. It just depends how you're taking that. You're being very dedicated, you know, very dedicated to yourself. You're, very, you're being very consistent in what you want and what you want to build and what you want coming towards your way. You're very you're you're being very guarded, Pisces. Okay? You know, you could have somebody come and offer you right now something. You're gonna be very, very guarded. You're gonna be very consistent about this because this past person was a fucking evil son of a I'm gonna say I don't give a fuck. This person I'm picking up some devil shit in this person. Like this person might have been, I don't know. No matter what she's saying, I have to say it. I can't share cool shit on my fucking channel. This person sold their soul to the devil. So if you release this past person, they're relying on your energy. Listen, this person will come into your energy whenever they want, even if they don't physically talk to you or even see you. Try for any means to not let this person see you on social media, with friends, talk to you, anything. Even though they can come into your energy whenever the fuck they want. Because I feel like this person sold this soul to the devil. I ain't even gonna lie. You're moving to bigger and better things. You're being very consistent. You're being dedicated. You're dedicating your time on yourself. You're trying to build. Okay? What this person destroyed. And some of you might still be in this energy with this person. You're trying to get out of it and don't even know how. You want family. You want somebody that loves you. You want somebody that's real. You want somebody to nurture you. You want somebody to give you what this person didn't give you. Twelve could be a significant number here. Hold on a minute. Or 2012. For some reason, I don't know. What else for Pisces? Listen, Pisces. You have a new beginning, a new beginning coming your way. Okay, some of you might have to travel a distance to get away from this energy. I'm gonna tell you right now, because this past energy that I'm picking up here, they completely sold their soul to the devil. I can't sugarcoat it on my shit. I'm picking it up. You might have to travel distances, states, you know, or maybe. <coughs> I'm sorry hours away you know and maybe a little bit more than that to get away from this person because there's so much in this person's energy that surrounds you you feel me i don't know if you have kids together i don't know if this person still comes around you but this person's trying to surround your energy or is surrounding your energy you have something new coming in here Somebody new is coming your way, okay? This person might try to get in the way, so be careful with this person. Is that this person's evil as fuck. What else for Pisces here, please? This person is so evil, my God. And even selling their soul to the fucking devil, they ain't got shit to prove it. Because, you know, like you're not supposed to sell your soul to the motherfucking devil. Because you ain't got no soul after that. You feel me? You're just the, the devil uses people. You feel me? I want your soul and I'm going to give you this and that. You feel me? I'm going to make you rich. Like all these artists. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. And yes, they boom up. Boom. People that can't even sing are out there. You feel me? But you know what he does is he gets your soul and he promises you things. And it might come in. You feel me? But at the end of the day... <coughs> this person might cough a lot <coughs> for some reason because I feel like I'm a choke. <coughs> I'm sorry. Um, this person, whatever they did and however they did that, they didn't. They didn't get shit out of it. It's like they have nothing to show for. I'm not saying here that it's a good thing to do and you're gonna get something to show for. I'm saying that. When they did this, nothing came out of it. They're still the same person they were before. 
You're going to get family. You're going to get happiness. The Ten of Cups is here. You're going to get what you want. You're going to get peace. You're going to get a family. You're going to get your life back together. But you need to remove yourself from this energy. And some of you might have traveled away from this energy. You need to. I don't know what you're going to do. But whoever's going to hit this with this person, you need to travel. Two or three, you know, hours away, maybe a state away, maybe a city away, something away from this person where they don't know where you're at, or nothing. Even though they can get into your energy very quickly, at least, you got to remove yourself. And for some of you, you may be traveling with this new person you're going to meet. You might just be traveling up and down, you feel me? They might work in a place where they travel up and down, and you might just go with them, you feel me? Man or female, it doesn't matter. You know, and have good times together, okay? And see things you haven't seen and, you know, new things that you have to, you know, experience with this person, you know? That's the beginning. Hold on a minute. What else for cancer here? And cancer, Pisces here, please. You might be getting with a cancer. Hold on a minute. Before I forget, you could be dealing with um, a Pisces. You could be dealing with a Cancer fixed with a Gemini. You could be dealing with a Virgo, another Virgo, and another um, Pisces. Hold on a minute. Which is you? What else for Pisces here? The King of Pentacles, whoever's coming in here is coming with, with abundance, very stable person, disciplined in what they want and what they need and what, they, and what to give. You feel me, Justice? I knew it. <laughs> I fucking knew it. Like, it, it, it had to come out. It had to come out. Like, listen, you're going to balance your life. Somebody's coming in here. It's up to you, Pisces, to accept this. To move yourself because I feel like you're trapped in this person's energy for some reason. It's like you can't let go for some reason. Even if you've moved on, you're trying to move forward. You're trying to look for a new family. You're trying to build. It's like this energy always comes into your energy and you end up thinking about this fucker. You stop thinking about this fucker and move on. It's their problem now. They're the ones that are like, they're the ones that are gonna get karma. Why? Because they should have never done what they did. You feel me? The universe is coming out to get them. You know? You just can't be setting your soul to the fucking devil and expect that the devil's going to give you everything. No, the devil's going to drop you right there, leave you right there, take your soul with them, and leave you the fuck there. And move on with your damn soul. You know, balance is coming into your life. Whatever you're trying to do, you're balancing your life. Whoever's coming in is going to help you balance your life. It's up to you to receive this person. This person is very stable. Okay? This person is going to be disciplined when it comes to abundance, family, home, whatever it is. You know? It's a person that's stable. But karma, damn, that person's going through it since the very beginning. You feel me? Like they sold their soul for no reason because they ain't got shit out of it. That's what I'm picking up. But they're still evil. I feel like they became more evil when they didn't see nothing coming towards them that they wanted. What um who is coming towards um Pisces here? The Knight of Wands. Somebody's coming here really fast to your energy. Okay, be careful that it's not this energy that I'm picking up here. This um, person here that's, you know, very, very evil. Be careful they don't come your way again, Pisces, and try to, like, damage whatever you're trying to build here. And for the most part, whoever's coming in here into your energy, they might be coming real quick, okay? Real quick into your energy, Okay. And, you know, don't let this person bump into the other person at all. Because it's going to be a big problem. What else is coming towards Pisces here, please? Strength. This person has inner strength. This person is very powerful. Whoever's coming in here towards your energy. It might just be this... um. 
person that I'm picking up that's so um, evil. Because this person has a lot of strength. They're enjoying their power. But at the end of the day, it's like I'm not even picking up whatever they asked for when they did this. They didn't receive it. But they have their own fuckery of evil. Because they're pure, e they're pure equal now. They're enjoying to see you struggle. They enjoy, you know, to see all the burdens that you carry. They enjoy everything you've been through. This person is very fucking evil. They don't give a fuck about nobody. Don't let whoever you come new with or whoever you're with now, don't let them bump into this person because it's going to be a real big problem. What else is coming towards Pisces here? Because your person ain't gonna have it. Listen, you know, this person, what can I say? They're pure evil, you know? It's popping up here a lot. This person shows himself to the world like, you know, <laughs> Um, a very good and nice and fucking gentle and fun person. A person that doesn't look like they would harm a fly. A person that will, you know, walk into a place and everybody will look around and turn around and say, Hey, what's up? You know, you're chilling. We vibe. And everybody will vibe with this person. You feel me? It's all like this person is like a charmer. They enjoy that very much, but they have nothing to show for. Pisces, whoever this is, stay away from them. They're getting their karma, and their karma is straight with the motherfucking devil, period. You stay away from this person and keep on moving because you got beautiful things coming towards that. You do not miss this opportunity because you're scared do not miss this opportunity because you've been through hell do not miss this opportunity keep on moving that problem is that person's not yours okay is there any message here okay that was quick it says stay optimistic about your love life positive thinking and faith will bring you romance i cannot make this shit up Leave that energy behind you and faith will give you your romance. You need to move forward. Somebody here is scared to move forward because of this person. Put your thinking into positive things. Forget about that person. Don't think about that person. Forget what that person did to you. Positive thinking will bring you faith into your romance. Okay? Stay optimistic. Know that somebody's out there for you. This person can't control you at all. They're controlling them. They cannot control you. Okay? So keep it moving. For yourself, Pisces. Okay, so I told my guide, you know, my ancestor to go in and, you know, with this spirit, um, this animal spirit oracle deck and have your guides give you a message. So let's see what your guide wants to tell you, Pisces. What is um Pisces guides wanna give Pisces here? What's the message for Pisces? Anything else? Let me see. Anything else here for Pisces from the guide? Yes. Okay. So we got two. Let's see. You got you got the black what jaguar. An old soul. Walk to life with confidence and grace. You have power from beyond the world. Focus on what you really want. You can create your dreams. Focus on what you really want. Move forward. Find your dreams. Find your happiness. Find what you haven't had in a while. Okay? Because I feel like this person wants to come in and interrupt what you're building here. It says, fo you got the fox. Clever. You are swift and smart. Solutions to problems are easily found. 
Always listen to your instincts, resources surround you, be open to romance. Your guides are giving you signs. Your Listen, if you think you can't move forward and you think that nobody's going to accept you and you think you can't do it and you find yourself in a position where like, where am I going to go? How am I going to move? You know, what am I going to do? Listen, just move out the motherfucking door. Move. Just start walking. Listen, your guides are going to guide you. Something's going to fall into place. Something is going to come towards you. And look, there's three cards. There's not even one, two. Like, move. There's a solution for everything. The only solution here that we don't have is death. And it's just our human body. Because we go back home. Be clever. You got the black bear. Guardian. Gentle and wise protector. Give me your confidence and power. Help me protect the ones I love. Awaken my intuition and guide me. This is what your guides want you to think and say. So if you need to rewind this and say this to your guides, go ahead and do it because you need to. This is from your guides. Okay? Let's pull out the dice and let's see what we got here. Past the present person. The war is coming in that you might think it is. Nicknames. Remember the nicknames. First, middle, last, initial. You and this person, past person, present person, or even a nickname for you and this person. You got somebody here, Pisces, right in front of your face, trying to offer you love. You have to take it or leave it. You know? Don't be scared. You got your guys helping you. You got to see. You got a Y. You got an E. You got another E. You got an I, which is also an H. You got a P. You got an E. She's telling me to pull two more. I don't know. I'm going to do it. It says, okay, you got, it says, you got an N, which is also a Z. And you got a Q. Q's are very odd to me. I don't know why. But, you know, some people have Q's their names. Let me see. So you got a P. That's two P's. And you got an S. Okay, so... You got two E's. I'm going to flip this E and see what comes out. You got another H, another I. Very significant. I'm going to flip this H, I, and see what I can get you. You got another C. So that's very significant here. You got two C's here. You got um, two P's. I'm going to flip this P. It wanted to stay into a P, so that's very significant. So let me flip this P and what happens. See what happens. You got an A. So since you got two C's, I'm going to flip this C and see what happens. You got an R. Okay? So listen, you know, Pisces, keep on moving forward. Leave this energy behind you. Oh, you got Aries down here, Libra, Leo. And I'll tell you the rest, right? And you got Gemini over here. I know I took the top because I always forget. Listen, keep on moving. Put that inner strength, that power. Help is coming towards your way with your guides. You need to reach out with your guides. Trust in them. Have faith in them. They're going to help you, okay? I'm going to wish you the best of luck, and I'll see you later, my loves.